In this video, we're going to use the live editor included with the Calibre WordPress theme to create a new page with a header graphic and multiple columns of content. We've created a page and we're going to give it a title. We'll paste in some content to the text editor. For the header setting, we're going to choose Show Header. This is in the Content Options meta box. In the Header Settings meta box, we're going to set the size to large. We're going to set the content source to no content and the background image to featured image. Now we need to set a featured image. Choose an image from your media library. Click Set Featured Image and publish your page. Now we can see our page with an image in the header and our content. Next, we want to use the live editor to modify our content and add another column. There's two ways you can access the live editor. If you're logged in in your admin bar, you'll have a button here for live editor. Or from your admin, you can click this tab and choose live editor. So let's go ahead and do it from here. We're going to click live editor. And now we're in the live editor. The control panel on the right lets you choose elements to add to your page. We'll start by deleting the default content that we added so we can have a fresh page and add the rows and create the columns ourselves. We're going to drag the add row element out of the control panel and drop it on the page. Now we'll do the same for the text editor, dropping it into our new row. Drop the element there, and we'll just paste in the same content we used before. Choose Save, and now we've got a page with an image and some content. But we want a multi-column page. So I'm going to go to the menu button here on my column container. I'm going to click it and I'm going to choose insert column after. Now we have two columns. We've got the one on the left and one on the right that's empty. If I wanted to add some text to this column, I go to the plus symbol in the top right corner of my screen, click it to open the control panel, drag the text editor element out of the control panel and drop it on my new column. We'll paste in some text, and we'll save it, and now we can see our two columns. If we wanted to make this column smaller, we can grab the handle and drag the column until we get the size we want. To make changes, just click on the text and it will open the editor. I'm going to give it a title. I'm going to make it bold. and I'll change its color to black. We click Save, and now we have a two column layout. When we're finished editing the page and we want to save it, click on the plus to get back to your control panel and update. And now it's saved and we have our new page with an image in the header and two columns of text in the body. That's the end of this tutorial. Thanks for watching.